Where is the Yardrat from Universe 2 in the Tournament of Power? Has he been eliminated by Cauliflower or is he still around? That's what we'll be discussing and more in today's Dragon Ball Super discussion. Now I personally think that since the Yardrats are a relatively old species that we saw in the Dragon Ball Z anime, we actually saw them uh, in person in the Dragon Ball Z anime during a flashback sequence, but only mentioned in the Dragon Ball manga. But anyway, since we have been introduced somewhat to the Yardrats and know kind of what they are, uh, well, at least in comparison with the other creatures throughout the eight universes competing in the Tournament of Power so far, um, it's a, a safe bet to assume that he will be sticking around and that he wasn't eliminated. I mean, he knows instantaneous movement, I think when Cauliflower just kicked him out of the way, I think he can teleport, you know, away and be out of harm's, you know, way. So I think the Yardrat, if I had to um, theorize and speculate, I guess, I think he is fine because he knows the instantaneous movement and can get out of the way of that stuff. Uh, even Goku um, was having a hard, tr like, hard time hitting the Yardrat uh, when he was teleporting all around the place. And even though that the Yardrats um, are not uh, are not extremely powerful, they do have techniques, very useful techniques like the instantaneous movement um, at their disposal, so they can use that to their advantage. And those are the Universe Seven Yardrats. We still have no idea about the Universe Two Yardrats that we are seeing now. Well, the one we are seeing now in the Tournament of Power, they can be, uh, they can be even stronger than the Universe Seven Yardrats and have more powerful techniques and more useful techniques at their disposable uh, at their disposal. So, yeah, I don't think the Yardrat is uh, eliminated. Also, I think they would cut to Zeno if he was eliminated. I think they would cut to Zeno. Uh, actually tapping on his god pad saying that the Yardrat was eliminated. Now you could make an argument that they wouldn't want to cut to Zeno because they wouldn't want to ruin and spoil the scene between Cauliflower and Goku, but I say as a hunch, just um, me watching the series, I believe that they would cut to Zeno because they've done that with most of the fighters and I think the Yardrat is rather important since Goku and Vegeta did mention him in episode 96 like they actually looked at him for a at least a brief moment and actually uh, mentioned him that he was a Yardrat creature so he does hold a bit of relevance in this arc even if it's just um minor compared to people like Jiren or Toppo. So yeah, speaking of the Yardrats, um, particularly the Yardrat from Universe 2 as our focal discussion point here, that does make me wonder, um, since I said before about the uh, Yardrats only being mentioned in the Dragon Ball manga, I wonder if Toyotaro will actually use the uh, Yardrat design that we see in the Dragon Ball Z and now Dragon Ball Super anime and take that into account and actually use the Yardrat design in uh, the Dragon Ball Super manga. I think, I, I believe he will and then he'll just say, oh so that's what the Yardrats look like. He'll just make some goofy comment uh, with Goku. I think that's the more plausible explanation rather than creating a whole new character or whole new design for the Yardrats. To conclude, I believe the Universe 2 Yardrat is not out of the game uh, just yet. I believe he won't make it to the finals obviously, but I think Goku and him will at least have a rematch and we'll get to see more Yardrat powers that we didn't see in the original Dragon Ball storyline because there was no need to see more Yardrat powers since the instantaneous movement is simply a Goku exclusive move and that's pretty much how it has been written. So yeah, I'm excited to see more Yardrat techniques um, if he did 
uh, not get eliminated. Hopefully he didn't, and I do have a hunch that he will return at some point in the Tournament of Power. But what do you guys think? Tell me in the comments section down below. I really want to hear what you guys have to say regarding this guy. So yeah, please rate, comment, and subscribe. See you later. Bye-bye.